All right, folks, real quickly before we get started, recently Cliff High has been confirming some of the things we've been discussing about the induction magnetometer. Uh, we'd love to hear what he has to say about the total electron content or the F layers. Uh, so if any of you know him and know how to get in contact with him, that'd be great. Uh, the focus of this is going to be Sunspot 11339 coming over the northeastern limb there. It's um, been responsible for two M flares uh, so far, uh, an M4 uh, last night and an M2 not too long ago. This sunspot was classified as beta yesterday, but today it is classified as beta gamma. Now specifically, uh, what that means is you have a bipolar group, both positive and negative, but it's irregular enough that you can't really draw a straight line between the two. And so what we're going to do is come over here to the magnetogram and zoom in on this and what you can see here is you can see you can't really draw a line between the white and the black and say okay that's that's the positive side and that's the negative side so uh, this is a beta gamma and uh, it is capable of producing M and potentially even X class flares and here's why all the things that we're going to list right now uh, are uh, indicators that it uh, could produce a significant flare of CME this leading sunspot group right here is the biggest. It is highly complex. It is impossible to tell exactly how many sunspots are here. And in this leading group here, we have a number of dark umbra separated by light bridges within the same penumbra. Additionally, this is a Zurich class F, which means it's a very, very large complex area. All these things make this very important to watch as it turns uh, the limb fully into the earth facing position. Now, if we come over here on uh, another thing on NOAA to their little and little spiral and on the top is the density and the bottom is the velocity you can see this is the CME that came out uh, it's, uh, a couple of days ago probably should hit us sometime this afternoon this evening maybe tomorrow morning at the latest um, so a lot of stuff to be focused on here folks and uh, I hate to toot our own horn but it's pretty much about harp and the Sun right now uh, keep your eye on financial markets as well and of course be safe